Hi, my name is Michael Bailey and today I'm going to demonstrate how to adjust the AC voltage output of the 3000A series multi-product calibrator. For information on how to enter the calibration mode of the 3000A, please see our other videos. Once in the calibration menu of the 3000 series, I'm going to move the cursor to AC voltage and I'm going to select the 2 volt AC range. AC voltage is different from DC voltage in the way that there are many more points to be adjusted. After ensuring the correct range is selected on your multimeter, press output on and wait for your multimeter to settle to the output. The first calibration point is the positive full scale at 206 Hz. Once the multimeter has settled, you can make your adjustments using either the cursor or the numerical pad on the right hand side. In this case, no adjustments are, need are needed. I will now press the range up key, which will change us to the zero calibration point, which is at the 200 millivolt point. Make sure you are on the correct range on your multimeter before making any adjustments. This adjustment point does look like it needs a small adjustment, which I'll just do using the cursors. The shift key has illuminated to indicate that an adjustment has been made but not yet stored. So in this case, I will press store. When adjusting the zero or positive full scale adjustment at 206 hertz in the AC mode, it is important to ensure that the balance has not been affected moving between the adjustment on the zero and full scale. In this case, you can see there has been a small effect, which I will just readjust to bring as close as I can and press store. I will now move on to adjusting the frequency flatness of the calibrator. This is where there are the most adjustment points, for example 10 hertz, 30 hertz, 56 hertz and so on until the maximum range of the applicable AC frequency. It is unlikely that all of these points will need adjustment each time, only typically the positive and zero need adjustment with perhaps a few adjustments at higher frequencies. Thank you for watching this short video. For further information on adjusting the 3000A series or on our other products, please visit our website at www.transmill.com.